Hey guys, J Pierre Pierre with another video from Shoutout Gaming. Today, I got a game mode for you guys on my favorite game mode, Domination. And it's actually going to be on one of those new maps called Frost. This map pack is so much fun, I've been having a blast with it for sure. As always, if any Shoutout Gaming members want to get any footage up on YouTube, just get with myself or Fantacular. As far as I know, we're the only two people in Shoutout Gaming that actually have capture cards. Speaking of that, how do you guys think the new PS3 and Xbox One will work with the new built-in capture cards? Because as you know, at least in Call of Duty Ghost, that they're taking away the theater mode. Personally, I'm not too happy about this because in that one chance that you might not be recording, it's going to make it really, really hard to get that footage done. Hopefully, these new capture cards are going to be worth it. Hopefully, it will actually capture a decent amount of time and not like the five or six minutes that I've been hearing around YouTube. We will definitely have to hear about that soon. Do you guys plan on buying the new Xbox One or PS4? Do you guys really see the value in it? Is the Kinect kind of creep you out? Let me know what you guys think down in the description on that topic. Me personally, I think I'm going to wait about three months. I think maybe around New Year's-ish, I think it should be pretty good by then. Hopefully they work out any bugs if there were to be any. What consoles do you think you guys are going to go for? you guys want the Xbox One or the PS4? I think personally, I'm going to go with the Xbox One. I'm a little bit of an Xbox fanboy. I know some of you guys might not like that too much, but hey, I've always used Xbox. That's where all my friends are playing right now, so I definitely like Xbox a lot. It's not that I'm not a PlayStation 4 fan. I just never use PlayStation enough to really like it. Uh, one of the big things I don't like about it is the fact that there is no party chat. That's kind of frustrating to me. I wouldn't like that too much. Back in the day, a bunch of you might know this, I actually used to do a whole bunch of modifications on Xbox and PlayStation 4s. And honestly, between fixing an Xbox and fixing a PS3, uh, it, the Xbox did seem to be broken a little bit more often, but it was a lot easier to fix. With that, and I definitely like the controller a lot more on the Xbox than I do. But as always, this is always going to be a personal opinion. What do you guys like the most? Definitely want to know. So I want to know, are you guys excited about Ghost? Because as you know, it is right around the corner. You know, I can't wait because it's driving me crazy. I cannot wait to play that game. I cannot wait to see where this channel goes and see if we can capitalize on Cod Ghost. Like I've said, this channel is going to be a compilation of all Shut Out Gaming members. If this commentary picks up, I might start doing montages of certain members and then doing an actual commentary of myself. We're going to have to see what's in the cards. Only time will tell. If you like the video so far, well, then you know what to do. You don't need me to tell you what to do been doing this long enough that you know what you should do. But I do appreciate every like and every subscribe that you guys have given me. Even though that I'm extremely small right now on this YouTube, I know SSG and myself can make this a very good thing. I do hope to beat more of the podcasters as you see on YouTube. Drifter, White Boy, Tmar, all those guys. But I want to put my own spin on it. Because if you want to see what they do, you go watch them. But enough of that. If you haven't heard, we are in the midst of making a new website. The website is going to be on SOGCentral.com, so definitely go check that out. Myself and a few other guys have put a whole lot of time into it, so I definitely want to give a shout out to Bryant for doing most of the web design. If it wasn't for him, we would not have a website. But there's a few things on the website that I want to mention. We're going to have an event calendar. So basically we're going to have hosted events, like Search and Destroy or Gun Game. Some of the lobbies will be closed events. Some of the lobbies will be pub matches. And the lobbies will be recorded and posted on YouTube. So definitely look for that. It's going to be a really, really fun thing to play with. It's a So if you want to see some of your footage put on YouTube, it's a really easy way to see yourself get on there. So it should be a whole lot of fun. So another thing I wanted to point a little bit of attention to is the first shutout gaming competition. This is something that myself and Fail Tackler have put together. So basically, there's going to be an elimination trip. You know like the ones that they use in March Madness, each player will actually get a chance at a custom built Xbox 360 controller. So you're probably thinking, wow that's awesome, how can I get in on that? So I'm going to try and do something special to make it a one of a kind controller. Show it off, display it as a trophy, or use it every single day. Well if you're asking me, well how am I going to give you that one dollar? On the website there's actually going to be a donations tab, and that donations tab will be set up to a PayPal account through SOG. If you feel like you want to support SOG just a little bit more than a dollar, then feel free to donate as much as you want. Everything is appreciated and we really do appreciate you guys helping us. Because as you know, these prizes don't come free of cost. But we want to do stuff like this for our SOG members, so it's something that we are trying to promote. And we want to thank all of you guys for sticking with us. If your name is not on the competition board when you see it, please let me know and I will get you on that board. There's also going to be a store coming soon. The reason why it's taken so long to get ready is because of the logo and all the copyright issues. You know, all that trademark stuff. So it kind of takes some time to figure out. 
But the end all goal here is actually have some hoodies and some t-shirts and hats and even like phone cases with the shutout gaming logo on it. Even with your name or rank. You know, all that stuff that you would want to see. Display your community, rock your name, wear it with pride. So enough about that. What is one of your favorite weapons in Black Ops 2? Do you like assault rifles? Are you a shotgun fan or a LMG or even submachine gun fan? Do you tend to cycle through a whole bunch of them, snipers and all that fun stuff? Or do you tend to just sit on one weapon the entire time? Me personally, I've been on an LMG rant the last couple of days and I've just been using the same weapon over and over and over and I've been having a whole lot of fun with it. That's actually might why you might see a lot of the same weapons in some of my videos the last couple of days. One of the reasons why I've been using LMGs is I've actually been using suppressive fire. And that's actually something you don't see very often in Black Ops 2. It's almost like it's uh, it doesn't exist. But actually at the end of this video, you'll see something that actually represents suppressive fire very, very well. Now it actually got us the B domination flag because of it. So check it out. Enjoy the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you really liked what you saw, press subscribe. And thank you and have a great day. Thank you so much for watching the video. Bye. Friendly care package.